Hi, I'm Sandy, branch manager of Easy Trail Adelaide, and this is my Easy Escape. So today I'm towing the Lincoln LX. The girls and I have had a bit of experience with this camper trailer. We love it, it allows us to have our own space. Generally, we have only taken it to caravan parks, but uh, this time we're free camping. So today we're in Port Lincoln. We're about six and a half hours out from Adelaide and we're heading down to the Lincoln National Park to camp for the night. So Port Lincoln's quite a big town. It's got all the facilities that you need. It has Coles, Target, um, plenty of petrol stations to fuel up before you head into the National Park. So after getting our final supplies in town, we had to make sure that we booked in uh, to the National Park tonight. You have to get a camping permit and a vehicle access permit as well. So that was all done online right before we headed out. As we headed into the National Park, the girls and I were in awe of the beautiful coastline, all the scenery. It's not something that we've experienced before. We had a variety of bitumen and dirt roads and the Lincoln just sat quite nicely behind us. It was a really great way to enter into the park. Today we're heading out to Donington Beach to camp. It is right near Cape Donington. You know you're near camp when you see the lighthouse. Jade was quite excited, so we hopped out and had a look around. The Donington Beach campgrounds, uh, it's a beautiful spot. We're right on the beach. The girls are looking forward to going for a swim later, climbing all over the rocks. So this particular campsite in Donington Beach doesn't have any facilities, so it is great that the camper does come with the ensuite as standard. Portaloo and just optional hot water. Another option I like to bring with me is the solar panel. So we can just plug her on into the Anderson plug and have power for days. The girls and I are a pro at setting up the Lincoln now. We've taken it away several times. This is our first time um, sort of being on the beach. It has generally been caravan parks but they know the drill, drop the stabiliser legs, take off all the clips, help me open it up um, so we can go explore. So we headed down to the rocks down on the beach. Uh, the girls were pretty keen to try out some more gymnastics moves. Everything's about gymnastics. We've got some great Instagram shots for our pages. So Port Lincoln is the seafood capital of Australia, so when you're down here at Donington Beach you're sure to see some boats and trawlers and where there's boats you're going to definitely see some wildlife. And I reckon I saw a seal. Oh, is that a dolphin or a seal? Oh, look we got wildlife. I'm sorry, distracted. I reckon there's dolphins playing just out there. See them? The Lincoln LX has plenty of storage so Besides having my fridge, my solar panels, hot water systems, etc., we've got enough for us three girls to be off grid for a few days. We have all of our bedding inside, um, allowing all the pockets and all the storage outside for clothing, bits and pieces, all our games, etc. And what I love about the Lincoln is being able to roll up the nice big window at the front. We've got a beautiful view of the scenery. We love to sit around and play a game of Uno in the afternoon. And then once we're finished, we can wind the table down, pop Amber's bed up. Jade has her little privacy screen up so she can sit there and be a teenager. <laughs> so once the girls are in bed, I can come out here and just enjoy the scenery and just listen to the sounds of the waves, um, have enjoying a nice glass of wine before heading off to bed. Although we're in a national park, we're only really an hour out from Port Lincoln itself, so we can still head back into town and go check out some experiences and uh, see what's around for the kids. We were told to go check out Glen Forest Park. They had a cool maze there, which the girls absolutely loved. But when we got there, there was so much more. I was lucky enough to uh, do some wine tasting while I was there. The kids got to feed all the animals. There was an awesome bird aviary, uh, the kangaroos and the bunnies. The girls and I have really enjoyed coming out to Lincoln National Park. Uh, for me, taking them out into a beautiful place like this is uh, still within my comfort zone of being off-grid but facilities nearby um, and quite comfortable towing my camper trailer into the campsite.